Hey everyone, welcome to I Just Watched. I'm Joseph. We're about to check out the official trailer for Avatar The Way of Water. I'm excited for this. I really enjoyed the first one. I went to go see it remastered when it dropped and I got a sneak peek of this which was dope and just made me even more excited. I'm supposed to get five. We can talk after. Let's just jump into this. However, gotta hit you with the usual. Just hopefully you like this enough to smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell to get notified. Let's check this out. Some beautiful water, my boy. Crystal clear. The pregnant, the prego belly. Dad, I know you think I'm crazy. But I feel her. I hear her heartbeat. She's so close. That was the scene I saw, the sneak peek. So what does her heartbeat sound like? She's talking about the All Mother, Ewa. Mighty. I really like these new exoskeletons, design-wise. We cannot let you bring your war here. Outcast. Let I know that voice. I see. Oh, that, uh, Navi, that's not, that's not the color's language. Oh, what are they called? Anyways, the way of water they have different lines. Before your birth, and after your death. This is our home! I need you with me. And I need you to be strong. So that one moment when you see him like touching the fin of the whale, that's the sneak peek we got at the remastered, relaunch, redrop of Avatar. It was actually a really cool scene. It was interesting the way they were communicating and it visually just looked beautiful. So I know it's gonna look stunning. I'm interested, I'm intrigued. They're called Navi, right? That's also not the language. I can't remember right now. However, I was trying to describe because you see one when he walks up there, the tail and the arms look different, almost like they've evolved to be more aqua or water friendly, so to speak. Probably, you know, faster swimmers or something, more capable swimmers, being that that tribe seems to be living on, near, or in water. I recognize that voice of the other tribe leader. Who is that right off the bat? If you know who it is, let me know down below. It sounds extremely familiar. Excited for the, the to see where this franchise goes. Like I said, the new exoskeleton thing, it's a neat idea. I just really like the ones from the first one because they're big as fuck and they just look intimidating. This one is clearly much, much more agile. Probably the idea behind it. And it's probably gonna be badass on screen. The underwater looking one, the submarine suit thing, that looks dope. Interested to see where this goes. I wanna know how much of a time jump's gonna be because I feel like there's gonna be a few time jumps but also why did they move there is it just where they relocated after the end of the first one because obviously home tree was destroyed and what or how long has it been since people have come back like they're clearly coming back to retaliate or revenge us humans Let's see how that develops are they still after unobtainium let me know down below what do you think what are your theories how do you feel about this are you excited for number two and are you excited because we're supposed to get five total if i remember correctly but i want to hear your thoughts comments questions concerns theories I absolutely want to hear your theories down below in the comment section. I love hearing from you. But until next time, stay safe, be well. Adios.